Hey everyone, it's Jordan from Fishkeeping Made Easy and today I'm going to have another go at a saltwater ecosphere. As you can see, this beach was littered with different seaweeds, different shells, all great stuff to put in the ecosphere. Now, I did have a look under some rocks and I did have a look under some of the big bits of kelp, but I couldn't actually find anything like crabs or anything cool to show you. We did, however, find a lot of these shrimp. So now it's time to start making the ecosphere. Now as always, I just grab a handful of the substrate that's in the water and chuck it into the jar. This is good for two reasons. One, this is where all the little critters live, but it's also where you get some good beneficial bacteria, which should lead to a long lasting ecosphere. One big mistake I made last time in my ecosphere was putting far too much seaweed in, which eventually just rotted and killed the whole thing. So this time I'm just putting in a little bit. It does look pretty disgusting right now, but trust me, it will clear up after a few days. So after a few hours at home, it started to clear up a bit and we started to see, this time, there was actually a few occupants. After a couple of days, it started to clear up a little bit more. happy with how this ecosphere is going right now as my last saltwater one just completely collapsed after a few days. I will be doing a lot more updates on this so make sure you subscribe and as always if you enjoyed the video please like it and I will see you in the next one.